Tip 28, want to save a model or pipeline for later use. Use job lib. And I've got a warning here. You must load it into an identical environment and only load objects you trust. So let's see our example. We've got a pipeline that ends in a model. So I'm doing a fit and then I'm doing a predict. I get my predictions and then I'm going to use job lib to save the pipeline to a file. So I'll import job lib and then I'll dump it which means save it to a file. And then this is the file name I'm using. This dot job lib extension doesn't matter. You can use whatever extension, but I just use it to make it clear what type of file it is. And then it tells you the file name here. And then you can load the pipeline back from a file. And I called it same pipe. And you can use that same pipe to make your predictions. And you can see we get the same predictions. So this is very similar to Pickle. It's specifically optimized for storing NumPy arrays, which is what Scikit-Learn uses. So that's why Joblib is more useful than Pickle for Scikit-Learn. In terms of those warnings, a pickled or joblibbed object can contain malicious code, so you should only load objects you trust. And you do need to maintain an identical environment. If you save this from Scikit-Learn.22, and Python 3.7.1, and so on and so on, you need to have that exact same environment when you load the job-libbed object back. Otherwise, you might get different results.